Also record this and uh, post this on YouTube later. I think I have the sound set up good. I turned it down to like 40% of what it was. So we'll see how that sounds. Well, looks like those are all set. Good enough. I don't believe the brightness and everything as default. Monomon, the teacher. It's a, that's a mouthful of a name right there. Well, that was something. Hey, there's our little guy. We a nice little stroll at night with some lamps lit. Oh, I guess those are actual light bulbs. See, I have no idea about any of this. I haven't uh, played this at all. No idea what the story is, or the lore, or anything. Are we collecting, like, Bug drops. I don't know what those things are we're picking up. I do like the controls, they feel really smooth. Guess we're a higher being. Collect souls by striking enemies. Once enough souls have been collected, hold B to uh, focus soul and heal. Oh, so that's what the little uh, mask thing there is to heal. The little mask at the top or our life bar, obviously. Bikes. I will get this coin. Or it's probably some kind of souls for a level up system. Huh. Yeah, I feel like down and to the left. Oh wait, do I have a map? Old nail. Focus. I don't know if I have a map yet. I don't know what button it is. Okay, we will not get whatever coin landed on the... F oh, wait. It didn't land on the far left. Ah, shit. Oh, that takes you right out. Okay, good to know. <laughs> okay, worth coming over here. We got some things. Wait a minute. Uh, B button. Okay, it doesn't eat eat all of my uh, base flask thing. It just uses a little bit of it to heal me. It's definitely worth doing if I fill it up from fighting enemies, right? 
I wonder if that works in boss fights. That'd be kind of different. You'd get health back just from fighting. What is that? Extra goo health? This gooey goober health? I'll take it. Oh, oh shit. I missed falling into that. Spot down at the bottom there, too. Oh, I can't make that jump. Can check out what's down here into the bottom, though. Yeah, if we had a special jump or something, we could probably go to the right there. We don't. Eternal Kingdom. Really didn't want you coming through that door. Look at our little guy just blasting it back though. That even has up and down attacks pretty nicely. Dirt mouth, the fading town. I'd say if there's only one person living in a town, I don't know if you can really call that uh, a town anymore. Rest. <clears throat> what does this do for us? Oh, maybe that's our quick save? Probably. It'll be open soon. Well, maybe we actually go out, find people, save them, bring them back to the town. Okay, there is a place to fall down here. Don't, uh, don't know if that's the way I want to go. It just fell out of it. No, it was just this thing. Thought I cut the grass and a sword or something popped out. He even bounced upwards when you hit them like that. It's kind of nice. There's probably something with the jumping system somewhere where. I guess we can't read. So we don't know what that sign says. Oh shit. It's uh... Not hard to lose health, I noticed. Kill you, man. I have to go back to work soon here. Only a couple more days before the season starts. That's how I feel. I don't know how to talk to this guy. So, uh, I guess that's the end of our interaction. Oh, Christ, they all came back.
This is a pretty big area. It'd be nice to have a map at some point. I wish I had a map. So if this way leads us to that. Oh. Oh. Jumped into that one. I did. Huh. Okay. Don't think I can get past that guy yet. Health is, uh, fairly generous, though, it seems. Ooh, whoops. Go for those falling stalactites. Ah. Just like a mini health fountain. Oh, there's no way I can get past down there at the bottom. All right, tell I need some kind of fancy jumping shit for that. That's not gonna happen. I feel like maybe I wasn't supposed to jump down the well, but I'm already going. So I'm gonna keep. <laughs> Is there a friendo? Are you a map maker? <laughs> yes. Hold LB to view the map of the current area. Oh, thank you. Kind of teleport system picking around. I feel like this is on the left side here, but oh, hello. My plan to hit it when I'm uh, aiming down did not quite work. I guess I can just jump past it. Wait a minute. Okay. So we don't have enough of the maps yet to see this, I don't think. Definitely want to get a compass. Oh, you create things out of your goo ball. Oh, sh no close. Falling spike got me good. Welcome, worm thing. Don't know what that was about. At all. <laughs> but 
we did explore this side, so... Maybe I could actually make that jump. It's pretty close. Nope, not quite. Almost possible. thrown around. Also, uncharted mapped area. Well, it's not, not worth it. It's a good little chunk of coins right there. Once we get back to town, we'll be able to buy, hopefully, a compass. I don't know how, how much you're going to charge for this. It's 30 for a single piece of a map. It sounded like that thing just like shit itself when it died. Find out what it does. <gasps> okay, then. So this is our fast travel then. Oh, cool. It shows a little track system that it has going on. Probably only have to unlock it once, I'm assuming. <laughs> I do like the animations in this so far. They're pretty nice. Oh, it's a uh, elevator. Okay, I guess it was locked so we couldn't get into here before. 
Hello again, friend. Yo, Lono. To go with. Hmm. Wait a minute. They definitely ran way past the house where these people are supposed to be at. Okay, here we go. To the right. <sighs> Bapanada. Okay, 220. That's uh, way more than I thought it would cost. It's kind of a neat idea that you have to buy these things for your maps. So we'll try to save up for those, I guess. So it's over to the right. We didn't go it go this way last time. Just fell down the well. And we cannot open that door, so uh that's the end of our exploration to the right. Hey, it's the mask thing from the beginning. Or I guess a great stone egg. I guess we have to run back to the entrance. I mean, I assume we kill three bosses and that opens up the egg or something. Some Legend of Zelda. Ocarina of Time. Type deal. Except for we probably won't travel through time by uh, getting like three amulets. Big boy. Hop and jump. I think you have a good little chunk of uh, things. <laughs> hey, little catter pillar buddy. Heal up. 
going to be a little bit harder to do that during boss fights, I uh, feel. Because I feel like they probably won't give you much time to stand still and heal. Sounds like someone's in here having a good time. This guy seems like a friendly bug. Okay. Yeah, sure. Compass, so I have no idea where I am. Just heading to the right here, though. I did get that quill pen, though, so... I know that trick. You, you break on me, don't you? Not gonna come down. Need some kind of downward break button pound. Safety test. Safe. Even though I wouldn't feel very safe on a piece of ground like that that's uh, shuffling around as you step on it. then we can't go that way either. But we are halfway. Yeah, that totally sounds like that guy's just fucking shitting his pants. When they explode. That's a new little buddy. What do you get? More than halfway to our goal. I like the sounds the caterpillars make, they're pretty, uh, pretty nice. Let's see, half an hour so far? I'll probably do this for maybe an hour and a half, two hours. Call it good. And then I'll finish, uh, Maybe not finish, I don't know, but I'll play some Star Ocean this weekend. Need to get through that game even if I don't want it. Down all the left side paths, so let's go down all the right side paths. They 
<laughs> we did go down this path, actually. Um... Maybe? really need that compass. <laughs> Yeah, we've we've totally been here. This is the this is the up up elevator. I should have marked out that whole area we went through, like all uh, all across there, shouldn't it? That's what the pen did. Marked areas you uh, walk through. You guys wrong about that? Oh, this guy. He's a caterpillar collector. Oh, uh, Yay. Okay. Neat. So that's what this is. We need to collect caterpillars. He was sad before. Now he's a happy old caterpillar man. Mystery solved. <clears throat> but uh, that was not updated on the map at all for uh, walking into it. Same with this one. So that pen... It's just garbage. Oh, those things didn't come back. Not surprisingly, they do give a lot of uh, money, so... Map updated. Oh, we have to rest and then we take our time to update the map, I guess. Okay. Neat. I'm assuming that big, uh, angry fucking face there in the middle is probably a boss. So we should head over to that, I guess? Still don't know where I am on the map. Couldn't break the wall, right? I tried that. Yeah, no, no. Oh yeah, this is the mini-boss area. Okay. So it's probably just above us, so straight over to the right and then up. Where we'll go.
pretty cool. You can just look down and then it drops uh, drops the camera down a bit. Okay, so we're still not over at the point where we can go up. Also go down too and explore down there a bit, but uh, I want to see if that symbol in the thing is a boss. If it is. Uh, I'm gonna try to fight it. We'll see how that goes. First boss, we should be able to take it down. Get whatever upgrade we get from it. over here to the right. I don't know what these signs mean. Well, I can't get... Actually, maybe I can get to that with some... Ugh. Ugh. Easy. Yeah, not so easy. Open slot. Okay, so maybe boss room or something? Or, I mean, once we go to the boss room, we can probably come back here and get whatever that is. Oh, what's this? A mini boss? Kind of getting further away from our goal of uh, going to the middle area. I just went with it. Uh, can't make that jump. There's a crazy guy in the house, which uh, probably not the worst thing. A little weirdo in there. This guy's just a drug addict. This guy's just out of it. Okay then. 
Look, we saved these little bugs that are high on the cavern fumes. We can uh, recruit them back to our main village. I don't know what they'll sell me, or I guess I don't even know where I am right now, so we even checking that out on the map. Okay, now let's go to that boss area, I think. Huh. Wow. I did just get hit by that. Just like that, we got our health mostly back. Big club buddy down here. Nice to get them. I did. Well, you can tell summer is coming in Canada. Everything is hot. This looks like. Oh, maybe not yet. Well, that totally does look like a boss right in here, though. Okay. <laughs> I like it. Oh shit. Oh, oh no. Get ah. your little goober face. Okay, so that's probably for the trolley thingy. Oh, look at this. Treasure chest. Did this hammer just get up and run away? It totally did, didn't it? Oh, dang. I was expecting, like, an upgrade for my character, but instead, here's a bunch of money. Yeah! Definitely afford that compass now. Old hammer thing run off to. How dare you just peace out on me? Oh, 
We'll go to the left here, because maybe there is an upgrade over here or something. Hey, that's when the little dirty map maker was kicking around. What about up here, huh? Can't get up top. Can I? Well, this looks ominous. But sure, let's head in. Ancestral Mound. Okay. Gwen on in, Mayor. A spell, huh? Did get some kind of an upgrade. <laughs> we just hit the floor. Doom the vengeful spirit. Definitely does have some impact with the uh, E button, but... It's not a very friendly floor. Oh. A knockback when you hit things is gonna probably kill me at some point. Well, I asked for those hits, I guess. Oh, do I not jump up there to get where I need to go? That's what I had to do. Okay then, um, back over to the right and down, I guess. Well, there we go. Give me that second health bar, Goober. Aha!
powerful abilities to equip your charm, open the charms menu while resting at a bench. Okay, cool. Where do I see our R1? Draw more soul from the world around them. Increase the amount of soul gained when striking an enemy with the nail. Okay. Cool. I want to have a cost, so it costs two. <laughs> we have a good chunk of uh, money now, though, so uh, that's good. Oh, we, we just have a bunch of slots and we can equip as many notches as we have? Cool. Okay. <clears throat> so if we go to the left and we just jump up, we can just get right up to Dirt Mouth. Maybe that's what I'll do. Also, see what that one uh, guy will give us for saving him. We can find him, that is. Uh, I think he's in this house because it's the only one that's open. Hello, buddy. A shop, huh? Patamas, Jill! So oh, that seems to be the key to the far right. Yeah, that's not too bad to grab. I don't know what that does, but uh, it's cheap. We can throw it in our inventory. I'll take this though. Then I'll buy the compass and probably one other thing.
I wonder if those get auto marked or we have to uh, mark them. Okay, no, it, it auto marks it. Okay, cool. Whoops. Sorry, old guy, you probably just got taken out by that. Uh, sure. Okay, good. We don't have to pay for that multiple times. So that's uh, nice. Just the one initial fee to unlock it, which will probably get higher and higher. Just an idiot? Where am I? Compass is a charm? Maybe. I can't remember. Oh, yeah, it totally is. I see it there. That's just a shortcut back up. Well, I'll just wait till I hit that lantern for that area. Yeah. My Geo is supposed to be picked up, like... Okay, it does get picked up. That's, that's good. So yeah, I'll put that on. I like that more. Yeah, there we are. Little face is on the thing. Preferred it if it wasn't a charm, but I'll take it. Whatever works. Mm. So we can go up and to the right and then down, or we could go down and left. I don't know what that symbol means. Maybe a town? It means something that we cannot get into yet. Or I have to activate it from below and then bring it back up and it's a shortcut. Oh yeah, I couldn't get up to the far right there. I didn't have whatever jumping ability I needed. 
Okay, this is a very spiky area. Yeah, sorry little catter buddy, but uh, you are not getting out of there. See you later. Jump on the spikes? Try this. That's ridiculous. I wouldn't have thought of doing this. Shit. Let's bounce you up very high. Oh, I can't even make that jump. Ridiculous. <laughs> well, I guess that's how you get past that. My roommate told me. He's played this game a lot. He likes it, so, uh... Oh, shit. Too far down. So it finally made me play it. I totally thought this uh, slot thing would be uh, for that item I got from that boss, but maybe not. Yeah, maybe that fits into the three uh, three headed egg thing. Then where do I want to go? Is it far, far left? I don't even know. I guess I can go up and try to go left. Oh yeah, this is the darkest shit area. Yeah, well there's a few places all on the far left here that I can go to. Even up. To the right. I feel like there's some kind of bug or something I can talk to in here or something. Something making some kind of noise. Whatever. <clears throat> Something stopped me from going over there, I remember that. Oh, 
guess it stops going to the left after a certain amount of time. This was stopped by one of those big goobers, so... That's where you get your goober. Okay, so this is definitely probably the next area we need to go through. A green path. Huh. Hide pretty good in there. Map for this area. Yeah, I'll take it. Maybe I can shoot those birds with my cannon. I did, but they did not give me any coins. So this isn't Resident Evil here. Map updated. But not really. Person looks like a friend. I think that's the one from Silk Song, isn't it? That's about all I know. Navi fairies, I'm getting all my money's worth. Hey, I didn't think hitting that vine would actually break it, smash it down to the ground, but it does.
got money for that kill. Oh, I, I, I know who makes that noise and leaves these pages around. Hey, friendo. I guess we have to find him in every area to actually get the map. Uh, better can just like buy them in advance at the store. Oh, hello, spikes. Unfortunate trap kills do not get you, uh, any of those little coins. Oh, dang. You can't go, uh, can't go back up now. Oh, hello, Catter, buddy. Each area probably has a crying caterpillar that we need to help. There's a way to the right too, we're gonna go that way. Bunch of teeth. Seems friendly. How's it going, buddy? Spura babies. Weba. Okay, so you kill a certain amount and you unlock some info about them. I don't mind it when uh, games do that for these little guys. Score you. Oh, they're undead even. Super gross. Probably not going to have very many of these. Uh, wait, was that us? At the end? Oh, okay, yeah. I think I kind of remember something about, like, if you die, you turn into a shade. Haven't had that happen yet, but it's going gonna, it's gonna to happen. It's guaranteed at some point, right? Oh. 
This is a fancy looking bench. minute I didn't see this little platform right there. Ooh. What she's doing in here, or how she relates to the story here at all. station here. second one. That is not a place I can walk up on there. That's not a beam I can stand on and break.
Okay, so we just went back to this area. There's nothing special. But not like it's a long distance to run either. Okay, that's a spot I can land on. I forgot they explode for a second. Oh. This is a little thorny path here to the right. Feeling I can't really get through this area just yet, but we're gonna try it anyways. Dang it. Foiled by our first difficulty. Light jump. Actually, I might not be able to make that jump. Hmm. Okay, okay. That's good enough. We, we attempted that a few times. Didn't work, didn't pan out. Sure, we get a dash or something here soon. Okay, perfect. We ended up going all the way around and back here. Wait a minute, what are you doing down there, buddy? Ah, shit. I won't know because I can't get to you. But I see you down there. Mental note, down here there is an item. Maybe I can, uh... Idea of breaking through. I pan out. Go out on a limb and say these. Yeah, those hurt. Get noted. They do not feel good. I should just go all the way to the right, or left. Oh shit. Wait, is this? Ah. And now what? That's as far as we can go there. As far as I know, anyways. Oh, 
Ah. Okay, that's a different spot. I can I can still get up to the left here a bit more. Thought I hit the same exact spot I was in previously. That I was locked out. That's a fail of jumping. Okay. doesn't explode. The left feels important. Oh, what's this thing? Ah. Well, jump in that. Is a bigger sword thing than I do. Kind of weird seeing all these like little mini bosses, like not real bosses. Dang, I did not even notice you pop out of the ground there. tunnels? Or are we back up in the regular tunnels? Just floating around in a circle. Akala, eh, man? <laughs> <laughs> oh, this guy should just let him be eaten. I feel like we're gonna probably end up saving this idiot several times. Works out. Oh wait, maybe we had to take this way because there's that uh, locked locked thing around here. Ah. Two of them at once is kind of uh, not so nice. Okay. 
Okay, perfect. Big bounty rewards. Oh, there's a couple. Okay, good. Rich. Up until we go to the map seller's place and buy everything out. Shouldn't have been scared by that, but uh, it did make me jump. Ah, dang it. Yeah, let's just get out of there. Fuck okay. it. I don't care. That noise is a caterpillar person. Tell. Actually, low health right now. Hmm. Oh, I don't like how it got so super quiet right now. Oh no. Seemed like a nice lady, but uh, I need to get some health back first before we jump down there and uh, die horribly. Hey, this might lead us to a... Uh... Yeah. Perfect. Rest stop. Mm. Uh, yes, we will use this toll machine. Jump back up. Spend all our... I'm assuming they're souls and I'm assuming they're lost when we die. So... I'm gonna use them up. Then come back here. I'm also gonna call that good for now. I'm sweating like a motherfucker. Soon enough, we're going to have to hook up the AC in here. Mask shards. That probably gives us like a... Okay, like heart, heart pieces kind of thing. Ooh, next one is 500. Vessel fragment. Yeah, we need to save up for that too, and that's pretty pricey. Lantern. Uh, that's right, map maker shop is on the farther right here. I'm just gonna kinda focus on buying them out. No, hey, it's this little derp. No, me too. So I guess these are things I can use to mark, right? I'm just gonna get our map just fully 
set up here. <sighs> Bapanada. Yeah, that'll be uh that'll be good for now. Progress will be saved. That's a good thing to have before you quit a game. Nothing worse than uh, quitting and then uh, getting nothing out of it. Extras. Oh, there's a few of those. I like that. All right, I'll see you guys uh, next time, and uh, try to stream more often, get more into it. I'll definitely be doing One Step from Eden more. I really play Valkyrie Elysium, too. <laughs> There's a lot of games I should be playing. I need to get through Atelier Rise of 2 as well, start the third one at some point. However, still, I've just been doing on my own. I'm like at the very, very last bonus chapter kind of thing right now on that one. It's been a relaxing, good game. I've enjoyed it. Adventure time, I'll probably just kick up one weekend or sometime when I have some time off and just relax and have a good time with that. I like the art style in it. It just looks just like the Adventure Time cartoon, so I'm assuming it'll be a good good time. Definitely I'll stream more One Step from Eden. With all the mods it has and everything else on it, there's so much, so much there. It's added a lot of content to it. Makes it uh, nice and good to play through more than one time. I've been playing this a little bit with my friends, uh, Heroes of Might and Magic 3. And it's it's an okay game. Uh, definitely a time sink. Like you, uh, you're putting as much time as if you were like playing a game of Risk or something, right? There's like just so much you have to uh, get into to do that. So I, I don't know how much I'll do of that, honestly. Especially once work starts up here, my time is going to be... I'll probably barely be able to touch most of this at that point here, probably next week or so. <laughs> Not looking forward to it, but it has to be done. All right, see you guys next time.